Welcome back to Age of Wonders 4. We left off here where we were being invaded again, and also in the back, which is unfortunate. Do I need more troops? I need more everything. But I guess what we're doing now is we are attacking. We are probably going to lose when we ought to battle this. Then we're going to do it manually. Oh. I am surprised. Now. We did lose a full stack worth of units. And while that is a pretty decent exchange, I don't think I can actually afford to lose that many units here, because there's just too much stuff going on. And I need to be able to compete with an AI that's in a much stronger position than I am. So we're going to play this out and try not to lose six units. Or if we do lose six units, try not to lose all of our most expensive and most powerful units. We lost both our Berserkers, I noticed, which is not, not great. Okay. Have I never thought to do that before? Yeah, let's just zoom out. Scroll wheel zoom. For whatever reason, I just felt like doing it, and then... Hmm. Alright, so this is... Which one is... Is this the... the NPC? action. I think it is, yeah, because it has a hero. Whereas these two are the actual opponent. Now, I don't know if that makes a difference or not. Now we've got these two Awakeners, which are really rough to deal with. They've got one over here as well, and one over here as well. We probably just charge this. That's uh, a lot of health and defense. Be strong hero. We, we probably charge with both of those and then move these guys this way and make these come to us, especially since it's a bunch of range types. In the back there. Okay, so if that's the plan. You guys have range 6 plus 1 because you're going to awaken. 4, 5, 6, 7. Okay. You can hit Taranath, but you won't be able to hit both units. That's fine. Invigorate. Do it next turn. Poisonous. Are you immune to poison?
Okay, my skull. Probably should do one of these right off the bat. Because it's on cooldown. Awakened both of them. Oh, nice. Well, at least they're not pure good. They don't start as awakened. But really, if it's supposed to be an Archon proxy, their leader probably should have started as pure good, honestly. Okay, this is interesting. So they're bunching up here to defend. Oh, this player hasn't gone yet. Okay. I'm gonna say, maybe we actually ignore this, but they're... Invigorate is AoE. I think I'd know that. In that case... Okay, we're not going to move you. So we're just going to... I should have moved some other units forward, but I didn't. Now from here, I should still have two hits. I don't. Could eat the retaliations. Cancel retaliation, but we're gonna take the hit. Let's not. We'll just eat it this way. And that lets you get your heavy hit in. Hey, we hit 250%. That's unusual. Okay, as for you... Uh, you can't actually move the way I wanted you to. Berserk and heal. Okay, we're going to move forward a little bit.
I'm not able to finish off either of those, I guess. Unless I run here, which is really risky. Um... You are melee, and you hit decently hard. Yeah. That's unfortunate. I'm hoping to finish this off before they get a heal, but if they spend their turn healing, I guess that's something they can do. I mean, we've killed their pikemen. All they have, they have three Awakeners, which is pretty bad. And two heroes, which could be risky. This stuff I'm not too worried about. So that's the overwhelming majority of their remaining strength. This isn't too bad, but I'm wondering if I split up my army and just deal with it. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. You can absolutely blast me if I stay pumped up like this. Probably don't want to charge into the pikemen. Spread out my troops a little bit. They're gonna hit three. If I go here, they can still only hit three. Oh, they could hit four here. Just do that to block. We could defend. No, I'd rather be up front. So the question is, do I want to provide defense bonuses, or do I want to not take AoE? I think we'll take go not taking AoE as the priority. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. You can hit here. It's pretty ridiculous. So let's not go there. And you get to heal next turn, and then I guess you're my last unit. I'm I'm feeling strong over here, but I know they're going to have so much health. Whereas I'm feeling a lot less strong over here because these wyverns are actually not very good. Uh, let's hedge our bets and just go here. healers are going to spend a turn healing a tiny little bit of damage, which is fine by me. I 
finish off one of my wyverns, almost certainly. It's fine. The wyverns have resurgence. Can't actually kill them. Was that a three? Was that a one-hit kill? Let's do so much damage. You just one shot my fury. If I focus all of my attacks on you, I want to cancel your retaliation for sure. Suddenly things are looking kind of bad over on that side. Missed the 90%. hits immobilizing phase. Uh, that should be a kill. Hero is not looking great. It's just these Awakeners, which are going to do so much damage. 45 damage. Yeah, I mean, it's got to be... Keep the dragon alive. And there's you. You're just a level 4 hero. a lot of damage. Maybe we just do that. Or we can roll for the 43. Okay, that was lucky. percent chance of stun. Well, it puts us in defense mode. I 
Low foliage obscuring. Sure, I'll try that. I don't know if that works on the dragon, but try it. I'm hoping that they try to kill the elemental. This is rough. I think we got burning. Nice. Okay, that's really good. That's decent. A graze and a miss at 70%, huh? I mean, I guess that technically can happen. The attack to make sure we don't accidentally heal our units prematurely. Now uh, we want to do that. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, that thing's not that strong actually, so maybe if we. Do that. The retaliation's pretty hard. Hits pretty hard. I'm gonna decide how I want to do my invigorate. I guess we're just not going to invigorate the, uh, the wyvern. still have movement. Let's just engage with this. Cause them some problems there. Let's have a few nasty things here. Seventy percent two shots or hundred percent at one. I guess we go seventy on two without cover. That was the correct call, I guess. Easy to say after you've seen how the RNG works. Uh, who else? Is that it for my movement? It might have been my my last unit. Yeah. This is still a little bit worrisome. This, I think, is mostly under control. Okay, they're going to finish off the wyvern. That's 
what the wyvern's there for. I think that's it for their heals. Hmm. One for my Berserker. I guess that makes sense. It was engaging you. Lost a shield unit, not too surprising. I uh, don't you guys have the unkillable ability? Or am I thinking of something else? Berserker's Rage gains steadfast when it reaches 33%. Okay, yeah. So you, they, I managed to lose both of those despite them being unkillable a turn after they take a bunch of damage. Uh, well done, AI. Alright, uh, you can't get anywhere. That is very unfortunate. Eighteen or... It's probably the better option. of retaliation. Think about hitting the hero. The hero doesn't do less damage for taking damage. I guess I shouldn't complain about the RNG so often because it does, you know, balance itself out generally. And the way the human mind works, it's something like for every 10 positive things that you that happen to you, like you need 10 positive things and one negative thing to happen to you for your brain to remember it is 50-50. Because the negative things just stand out more for whatever reason. It's just how how humans work. Okay, that's a decent hit. Theory. It was a decent hit, and we even got the status. Nice. Uh, that's not bad. We're going to spend all of our range attacks on that. This is Rally Haste Regen. Hmm. Could, or I could just... Well, I could run forward regardless. Immune to Berserk, yeah, they're all immune to mental effects, which is not ideal. Pretty hard. Now they're going to hit me less hard. Yeah, I think we just do it.
Cancel retaliation gets rid of both retaliations. Nice to know. And that doesn't let me go this way still. Okay. Unless I do this. I mean, we still get two hits. Immune to taunt. Yeah, we have a bunch of uh, fun mental slash spirit type status effects that just aren't going to work because the enemy started with angel angelicize. That's unfortunate. Uh, nobody else here has... Uh, you still have an action. And I probably should just finish the spear off. But... I feel like occupying them so that they're forced to move. At the very least, it prevents you from doing this. Which you can't do anyway. But it also costs you a spirit bolt attack, because you're going to have to step away. So I think... When they only have ranged units left, that Spearman's not that much of a problem at this point. Okay, you, unfortunately, can't get much of anywhere. Let's see what they do. Yeah, they stepped back. And they, I got them to step back, so the Wyvern's mission was successful. Now you're not winning this fight. And the fact that they're gaining morale for killing my wyverns is actually probably good for me. Because uh, that means that they're less likely to flee. That's back. Well, you're only hitting two units with it. That's not that bad, unless I lose the fury. Dragon. Okay, um, over here. I think that's the play. Get our melee hero up in melee range of both of them, although I guess only really one of them matters. Haste and regen a bunch of people if I do this. I guess you have to move here. That's uh, not a lot of damage, is it? Oh, we did get burning, though. Because okay, we're hasted, let's uh, try to support the, uh, the fight over here. Thirty-three. You need all three hits to kill. Oh, 
I do this. Uh, 24 is still a kill. And that gives you... Let's let you go in first. Yeah, you are definitely going here. Um, I'll be able to finish you off. Still do a decent amount of damage. This doesn't work on heroes, does it? Nope. Holy Retribution. Let's do it this way. Okay, and that should finish you off. You're going to take a ton of damage, but... Crit. Uh... We got it. Are you fleeing? Not yet. You could still lose a, a big unit here. Yeah, do it this way. Should be fine. Still fighting, you're just low. Low morale, I guess. That's why it's blinking. mode that was a they probably the best option they had unfortunately yeah you're gonna kill something fumble maybe not okay I could run over here and finish some stuff off or I could use my heal. The heal doesn't actually matter though, because that's only if we... Finish the... F if we don't finish the fight. Two units plus all the wyverns. Or did I lose a third unit that I forgot about? Two units plus the wyverns. 
Now, do the Wyverns not get experience if I let them die? I did restart my computer. I'm running literally nothing. Aside from what I need to run this. So it's just kind of slow on the loading. Alright, yeah, so I lost two units, uh, but they weren't particularly valuable units. So that's fine. Because the low tier units in this game are not very good. Just because of how the stacks get drawn into the fight. Uh, I can't see if you guys got experience or not, can I? Hmm. I guess I just have to remember. Well, that was pretty good. And I can attack this stack with just these 10. I don't have anybody else with enough movement to get forward. 11. Okay, well I can do this. And hope that I don't lose my dragon. Or this Fury. I don't think they'll be able to hit anybody before I have an action. So there should be no casualties. I might have to do it myself. Uh, no. No casualties. Okay. Good. No damage, even. Okay, well that helps. Uh, we definitely... want to go back and deal with the other stack, which unfortunately means they're not pushing forward. You are Archer. Okay, so Demon Step, not great. Uh, Blink? Blink might not be bad. I'll be boring and take Summon Elemental, because it's the best skill that's available. Increased crit chance, that's actually probably pretty good. Or plus one range and plus ten accuracy on an archer? Well, obviously. Okay, we have two more people in the crypt, and we're just, uh, I, don't, I don't even know why I'm looking. Like, it doesn't matter, I'm just gonna sell the remains because I want the money and I want the income. I guess I'll look just so I have a sense of what I'm getting. Some stuff. So now the question is... How did you get full life? Temporary hit points. I don't understand how you have full life suddenly. Wand of healing. I mean, that's pretty nice, too. Defense and accuracy. Or defense and vision. No, we'll go with accuracy. Switch to a wolf. The okay, ring of regen on you makes a lot of sense. Orb of seeing doesn't really matter, honestly. I wonder if those stack. Oh, you're not allowed to. Right, you're not allowed to equip two of the same item. Otherwise, I would put another one on the dragon. Okay. Yeah, because I want to come up here and invade Citadel. 
But I have this army to deal with. I don't want to lose a city again. Alright, we did just get a bunch of money. build something there. Get another Scald. And those Berserkers are actually pretty nice. We'll get into one of those. Okay, well I think that's all I'm going to do for today. I'll probably end that off really want to go this way. I don't know. I'll figure out what I want to do next time. Uh, I will see you then.